Hi, and welcome back to the PGA Tour career mode. I want to thank all of you that have been watching the videos, leaving likes, and those that have left comments as well. It is very much appreciated. I want you to know that we left the first round at nine under par. That was a pretty good score for us. The best first round we've had in this, tour, in this career mode so far. And it has lined us up perfectly to get our first victory in a career mode where we have chosen not to use a driver in our golf bag. So, go ahead and leave a like on this video. You've been highly entertained in that first round. Let's see if we can keep that entertainment level up for the second round. Here we go to the second and final round at the House on the Cliff and the Lunenburg Championship. Here we are on the first tee. Looks like we're going to have a little bit breezier conditions this second round. Hopefully we can combat them properly and get our first victory in our Corn Ferry Tour and our quest to earn our PGA Tour card. Solid first tee shot there, landing it right in the middle of the fairway. If we remember from the episode we had yesterday, this is our best solution here, to just play this shot at the end of the fairway because our club and our angle does not allow us to make an effort all the way to the green. Now this is where this shot becomes challenging. Into the wind now instead of with the tailwind. Perfect. The wind is really pushing that shot right now. Hopefully it holds it up well enough for us. Looks like it has. Gently rolling on up there. Nice 10 footer here. What can we make happen out of this? Look at that, we were barely on the edge there. And we get it to fall. There we go, starting the round off right with a birdie to bring us to 10 under par. Here we are at the fifth hole. Nice side mile an hour wind here. Perfect, but the wind is pushing it back in. Hopefully to the middle of the fairway. Looks like that's what it did. Challenging hole here, if I'm not mistaken, we are still gonna be short on our second shot here. I 
Another almost perfect, slightly slow, but it should be okay. All right. Back-to-back -back shots in the fairway on this long par five. And we're still 150 yards out. That's pretty crazy. Let's see, there's the flag. Perfect, perfect, perfect. That's what it's taken us to get to this third shot here, landing on the green. Three perfect tempos in a row. Here's a birdie attempt. And we make it. <laughs> nice. Okay. Bringing us to 11 under par. Playing some pretty good golf here. Vincent Peck is still at 9 under. Heading into the ninth hole, we have a one-shot lead. Vincent Peck is just pecking away at our lead. You like what I did there? Pecking away. Oh, I amuse myself sometimes. Maybe I'm the only one that's amusing. I think I don't want to put it all the way out there for the full eight because I think the wind will push it back just enough to then push it down the hill. If I'd have pushed it all the way out to the 8, I probably wouldn't have ended up as close as this looks like it's going to get. That was the idea. And I'd say that was a good idea that paid off for us. I guess the only payment that would be paid off is if we put this putt in the hole, right? That would be a good payment for a shot like that. Getting a birdie. Yeah! There we go! Payment received! Birdie, 12 under. Nice! Strong, 11 mile an hour sidewind here. Pushing that ball back into the fairway for us. Got a solid tee shot there. Starting the back nine off right. Still going to be short here if I remember correctly, but... Oh no, I did it again. Back to back rounds and I do the same thing again and again. Ay ay ay. Second shot on that tenth hole. This isn't very good for me, is it? Splash this thing up there. Put some backspin on it. There we go. I like where it's going. Nice. Well done. That was our third shot. Can we get back-to-back -back birdies here? Oh, come on! 
Oh, perfect reaction for my golfer there. Oh, man. Okay. Well, I saved par. Start the back nine off. What's a par isn't terrible, but that's a really scorable hole, and we botched it up two days in a row. Okay, perfect tee shot here. Wind and slope should push that back into the fairway. There we go. Still getting some good roll out of that. Oh my gosh, I think that's the furthest we've ever hit a ball. 283 yards, right into the middle of the fairway. Uh, I'm gonna hit this, this club. It sits close up there, and I just wanna be careful. Nice, perfect. I don't think I compensated for the wind enough on that. Holy cow. Okay. Ouch. That was still probably too much club. Holy cow. Wow. Okay. Fair enough. <laughs> right, right into the middle there. We get our birdie. Here we are at the 16th hole, downhill. Perfect tee shot. Perfect on the power, perfect on the tee shot, perfect on the aim. Holy cow, we got that really close. And there is your house on the hill right there on the right hand side. Didn't notice that before on the first round, but I'm putting it out now for y'all. Come on. Yes, okay. Getting ourselves to 14 under par. Hopefully that leaves us clear enough 
to come away with our first victory ever. Oh, and I did it again. I hit us slow again, darn it. But I think the fairways are wide enough. We shouldn't be in the rough. Except for this time we are. Sometimes I just have to open my big mouth and it gets me in trouble. Like, that shouldn't be in the rough. Watch as it bounces into the rough. What on earth am I thinking here? You know what? I want to kind of do a partial shot here, and this could get me in some serious trouble. But I'm going to do it anyways. Okay. Perfect, perfect. Just, just get close to the hole for me, please. Wow! That was way too close for comfort. Oh my gosh. Oh, wow. Okay! Nice! Well, we've decided to put our foot on the pedal extremely late in this game. As we head to the 18th tee, we are now 15 under par. Everybody else has finished, barring a mega meltdown on this last hole. You are now tuning in to Noble Panda's first victory ever without a driver in the bag. Thank you all so much for watching. L leave a like on this video. Comment down below. Congratulations. Thank you, Noble Panda, for bringing us a unique PGA Tour style victory here. I appreciate all the views, all the comments, all the likes. It is much appreciated. Leaving ourselves. He's happy with it. Leaving ourselves 10 feet straight in for the victory. There we go. Look at the fist pump. He is ecstatic. And we did it. We finally get our first victory without a driver in our bag. What a moment to take in. What a journey it has been. We are one tournament closer to finally being on the PGA Tour. Four shot victory for Noble Panda today. Hope y'all are having a great day. Catch you on the next episode, which should be the last tournament in the Corn Ferry Tour, and then we'll be on the real PGA Tour events with real players in the game. Have a great day and take care.